cool, everybody. It's a lovely sunny day. Oh, some cloud. And amusing as well because uh, when we left, it was really cloudy and threatening with rain and and that. Yes, it is a bit windy. Uh, it's very, it's quite flat around here. So this is, was once a family uh, farm owned by the Wagners. And it's still owned by the Wagners. Now the uh, Wagners are a very um, uh, powerful family, fairly powerful family here. They own a, quite a bit of Toowoomba, but it's all regional, well outside of town. This is a, uh, a good, probably five miles out of town. And what they did with all this flat land, because it was just swamp, is they put an airport in. So this is how it essentially is an international airport. Privately owned though. And what they do what they're doing to uh, help make ends meet is that they've rent they're um, leasing out bits of land you put up your own building and uh, so they get a good substantial amount of rent as well there's a lot of flies here but you kind of expect that with farmland I'm trying not to eat any and uh, what the Wagners are they started off just with quarries and that's why you see there's lots of built up dirt everywhere and uh, they've got a hill behind us way behind us and that's their main quarry so a, and they own all this to the eye as far as the eye can see so they wouldn't have paid much for it back in the day. So this is, uh, I think they're on third generation now. So the first generation would have bought this farmland when Toowoomba was just, was just a, a country town. Timber buildings, one street, back in the 1890s. Yes, Toowoomba is very new. It was just a training post. That's all it was originally. It was a training post. And it was all farmland. That breeze is nice. And there's a road, main road bed they put in behind us. Oh, these flies are annoying. So what the airport is, as I say, it's an international airport, but it's for international freight at the moment. Uh, they're competing with Brisbane. And uh, the advantage is with freight is that we're not that far from Sydney. Well, it's an easy run to Sydney. Basically just one highway straight down. It's about 1,200 kilometres but it's straight, straight there. There's a good, main, well maintained highway. It's only a two lane, so one lane down, one lane back, but it's well maintained. And now that they're uh, putting in a train to Sydney, and the train goes, what are you two doing? I think the train's planning to be just south of here, uh, just a little bit further ahead of us. Oh, there's a plane taking off. A little plane. There's some plane spotting. So these be uh, just farmers and um, uh, charter flights. 
think he got a fly in his ear. <laughs> Poor boy. You want to stop and get that fly out of your ear? No, not really bothering you that much. Probably was in there and it's flown away. No, he's just taking a break. Just taking a break. So yes, this, uh, these roads are all probably privately owned. And yes, I am videoing on private property. You just wait for security to turn up. Like, what are you fucking videoing? You're not allowed to. Well, I'm not really videoing much. Green, green grass and tea doggies munching. And flies, lots of flies. building up there is the uh, dog pound. I didn't even know that. Well, not just dogs, it's uh, the uh, rescue, animal rescue shelter is up there. Well, we'll continue our walk. It's just more of the same as we walk around the airport. So if I see anything interesting, I'll video it. <laughs>